Well, 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 good morning. And you are tuned back into another episode of Lock Valley Farms. And today is the day we're finally going to pull the header or combine Murica out of the shed and give it a clean off. Well, as you can see, gonna have to do a bit of uh, machinery, musical chairs to get this thing out. The old loader behind me here, that's, uh, that's not gonna be very fun to start. The glow plugs don't work in it anymore. For anyone who doesn't know what glow plugs are, they're little heaters on the, um, on the air intake side. They heat up the air before it goes in to help the engine start when it's cold, they're not working, so I'm gonna have a hard time even getting that thing out the shed. But anyway, let's get on with it. Time for the good stuff. It's a charm every time. <laughs> Don't know what I was worried about. Started easily with a little bit of assistance. Damn mice. Making home in our tractors. Ugh. I guess I better start by getting some covers off this thing. Let's go move this thing away from the shed and uh, somewhere where I can at least get a little bit of airflow. It's not a very good day for doing this because there's not much wind out here today. It always seems to be windy here but the day that you want a little bit, there's none. Let's go get ourselves a compressor and get moving. What better things could you think to be doing on your Sunday afternoon? But to be honest, this is a job that I would have done about four and a half months ago, given um, any other year, but we just finished harvest so late. Uh, it was so close to Christmas time. The family wanted to get away. You know how the story goes. We just sort of packed up and 
and went away and had a break and and since then since we got back to the farm and sort of got busy working again it's just not really been on the priority list to pull this out and get it clean so no better time than today we're hoping to be maybe doing some dry seeding in the next week or so we still haven't had any rain we really would love some rain we do have a possibility maybe next weekend so we may try and get out uh, all going well and get a little bit of vetch in the ground before we get that rain but we'll see how the week pans out but for now, let's get going. gonna move around that wind is just swirling around everywhere it's terrible part is I'm only about halfway done but that sounds like a problem for future Henry after some lunch <laughs> all right lunch is in and I tell you if there's one thing that makes you feel less like coming back to work it's a lunch break on a Sunday when the weather's really nice <sighs> anyway let's get this thing done guarantee you all of this is going a lot quicker for you than it is for me I am dusty I am itchy <laughs> but I'm down to the last couple of jobs so we'll knock those off and then this thing's ready to be put away for the winter and I'll forget about it until we start pre-harvest maintenance on it
Rightio, there's one more thing, or a couple more things that I need up here. And they can go straight onto the tractor for seeding. put this thing back in the shed I've uh, left most of the covers off uh, well I've left all the covers off from the side of the machine I figure there's not a lot of point in putting them all back on because as soon as we come to do a pre-harvest maintenance uh, we're gonna have to pull them all back off again so I've just put them in a pile down in the corner there hopefully if I'm on the front foot which I should be once we finish seeding the crops are in, everything's coming out of the ground, I'll I'll um, start doing a bit of work on this. So I'll leave them off for now. Um, I'm going to go out and grab that compressor from out in the paddock and then I'm going to call it a day because it's Sunday and it's already getting late and well I've had an absolute enough for the day. I'm itchy, I'm dusty <laughs> and I'm tired. <laughs> so thank you very much for watching the video guys. Uh, give us a thumbs up if you can, that would really help me out and we'll see you all next time. Cheers.